that'll dangling out in the ocean. Throw our uh, lines out there and put a little dangle juice. See what we can catch out in this uh, deep sea and then uh, maybe hit the river a little bit later. High tide's about 2.30 here in good old Washington State. Do it up in both uh, both uh, fishing arenas there, and get some salt water going and some fresh water. It do like a uh, catch, to clean and cook. Way. That's what we're gonna try to do today: catch, clean, and cook. save these guys here for river fishing they're good for salmon i'm gonna go with the one ounce we got a few small ones on there i'm gonna go with the uh let's go with the old bandito bug yogan baits give the old dangle see how that turns out for us Okay, so first spot, not so good. We had a couple bites, but I tell you, fishing in the ocean is something else. Oh, does it look like my face is all dirty? Oh, it's the sun. Ah, it's the shadow. I'm gonna do this little number. Yeah, look at that. It looks like I got a five o'clock shadow going on. It's five o'clock somewhere, right? Anyway, we're gonna go to uh, the Puyallup River next. Um, Coho and Chinook are running. Do a lot better combat fishing for salmon, so. We're gonna do it to it. Stay easy peasy and watch the rest of the episode. Thank you for joining us. Look at that beautiful beast right there, just hanging out doing mountain things. Oh yeah. All right, so we are going to be heading down to get some more, more uh, fishing lures and some weights, because uh, Pacific Ocean is very unforgiving, and I lost a lot of mine there, so gotta go replenish before we hit the river. I'm tired, it's been a long day, got some sun, but uh, it's worth it. This is what we do this for. I live for this stuff. Okay, so we got our baits, uh, everything I need that I, 
I lost and stuff that I did not have that will work out amazing. Wow, let's let's put the camera up right so you guys can see me. Um, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it to it. Let's get out of here. Ooh, I'm going down to the river. I'm gonna catch some fish and cook it up and clean it. Ooh, every day of the night. The dang train is stopping us from getting to our destination. What are they doing? Look at it. Look, I can't go nowhere. See it? What the F? Oh, oh, it's, oh, yeah, okay. That's real. All right. Whew, I could have died there. Yeah, buddy, let's get it. Now we're free to travel, gonna do it, do it, do it, do it. I just gotta eat. I don't um, endorse this place at all. Don't eat here if you're trying to lose weight. Sorry, I was a little insensitive. <laughs> Two McDoubles, max size only. Two medium fries, only $6.99. That's a bargain right there. They even say it's real beef. Real beef. y'all it's been a real hot one i'm burnt to a crisp but we had a good old time out here fishing for these uh chinook and caho salmon we're gonna get home and wrap this video up and show you what you're working with so we came home got everything all put away that was an awesome awesome day of fishing i told you guys we were gonna do a catch clean and cook so let me show you what I'm working with. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Isn't that amazing? Some Caesar salad, some nice T-bone steak. Look at that, look at that. You can get that anywhere. Safeway, Walmart, Fred Myers, Albertsons, QFC even. You just go in and buy it. Way, way easier than catching a fish. It was crazy out there. They are not biting right now. They're just not. And I swear, I'm using the best bait there is. Anyway, enough of the excuses. Thank you for watching i5 Tactic. Go ahead and like and subscribe right now. Go ahead and do it. It's right below the video. There's also a link in the description. Go check that out for the new clothing line that's available. You guys have a lovely day, and I will see you next time.